Okay, art students, today we are going to be drawing a little farm. And on your little farm, I want you to think about what it is that you're going to grow. I will show you an example of what I want to grow in my farm, but maybe you want to think of something else that you want to grow in yours. So let's begin. For today, you're going to need a pencil, you're going to need a permanent marker, and some coloring crayons. Okay, so let's begin. Let's start with our pencil and eraser. We are going to draw a line right here. And very simply, this is the line that will tell us that this is the ground and this is the sky. Okay, so what we want to do is we want to start thinking about um, what are we growing, okay? I know what I like to grow in my garden. I like to grow tomatoes, but before you plant your tomato, you need to make sure you have a tomato cage. So let's make some tomato cages. To do a tomato cage, you'll draw a line that comes down like this and another one that comes down like this and then notice that they kind of come at a slight angle inward i want you now to draw several oval shapes that go like this and maybe one more down here and then maybe um to do the tomato plant we'll have it grow up like this. And it has lots of leaves and lot it actually kind of branches out like this. And there's tons of leaves. Oh, and then of course you're gonna need to make some big round juicy tomatoes okay so there's our tomato plant then what we're gonna do is we are going to draw let's see let's do how about some corn the corn will come up like this on a stock and there's several leaves that come out like this and then <clears throat> we'll make little um, ears of corn which are like this it's almost like a football shape except it's a little bit more narrow and then maybe we'll have some tassels growing out the edges and tassels off the top. Okay, so there's our corn and we'll make it look like it's ready to unwrap. And then ooh, what else can we grow in the garden? How about some lettuce? Notice how I ha kind of have it wrapping around here. Here's some lettuce. Maybe I'll do one more lettuce. If you're growing lettuce, you usually you don't do one kind of lettuce. You do a few different types of lettuce. Okay. So now what we want to do is we want to, um, let's see here. We want to find some crayons. Or actually, we're going to do our permanent marker first. We're just going to really quick overlap all of our lines. And I'm just going right over top all of my lines right now. wonder 
if some of you are growing a garden at home. If you grow a garden, you can eat the own, your own food that you grow right from the ground, and that's pretty cool. That's what we like to do here at my home. I gotta just do this tomato cage here. There we go. And, oh, we have one more little spot. There we go. Okay. So after you do all of your lines with the marker, then what I want you to do is jump into the coloring crayons. But before I get that far, I will do that in the next video. So I'll see you in the next video.